All right, guys, so here's my Bradley mower, and I just got it out of the repair shop, and um, I had to get a pulley put on it that uh, I actually needed to pull it before I had the engine uh, changed out. Uh, before Brie Hicks uh, wanted the engine for me. I, need, I already need to pull it. So I took it to my guy that services it for me and uh, he put me, uh, the pulley on for me. So I'm gonna put it up because I'm, I'm not gonna go out until tomorrow. So we put it in my shop. videos back uh, I showed you a house that I did that was very possibly the last cut for the season for that home but uh, I was showing you the pine straw in this guy's beds and I told you I was gonna send him a text and uh, see if he wanted to replace his pine straw for the holidays and I told you that he would probably say let's do it well today I'm back at that property take a look you know, redone for the holidays. It's December. Hey, first of December, get it done for the holidays. It'll be looking festive. I'm gonna send him a text, and I'll probably bet you that's finished product. I'll bet you a hundred dollars to an oatmeal cookie that I'll do a video doing a pine straw install here in the next week or so. All right, guys, John Ud Upscale. So I'm returning to a property today. Take a look. You should remember this property was in the last video. And in the last video, I told you that, um, well, we did the lawn. We did just regular lawn maintenance on it. And I told you that I was going to shoot this guy a text and uh, tell him that he should think about uh, replacing his pine straw, hey, for the holidays, give it a festive look. And uh, I told you, I felt like he was going to say, hey, let's do it. And guess what? He said, let's do it. So today I'm going to be replacing the pine straw. And uh, I may get a little footage, and then I'll bring you back a finished product. All right. All you have to do, guys, is talk to the clients that you have. Once again, uh, you know, I, I, I continue to get questions uh, about, you know, how do you come up with the winter work? How do you get the winter work? You have to ask for it a lot of time. Next thing I'm going to do, I don't want to do it today because uh, this is coming up to Christmas. We're going to be kind of busy the next couple of days. Next is going to be those crate myrtle trees. He had one right in that corner there, but. He's taking it down, but Dale's one on the end. And I was going to do his bushes today, but he's got Christmas lights in them. And I'm not going to take that stuff out of there to do the bushes. So I'll do the bushes at a later date. So I'm just going to go ahead on and get his pine straw installed done. And uh, hey, there it is, guys. All right, guys. And so all the pine straw is down. And all I need to do now is just clean it up. There's that side. There's this side. If you notice, guys, I'll put this tip out there when you're doing pine straw. Make sure you fill that bed up with straw. Because um, you have some guys who think, you know, they can just put a little in there and keep some off of this job to doing the next job. No. Whatever you tell the people, like this right here. This one was 14 bales. So, you know, 14 bales goes in the, in the beds. Fill it up. Because people come back and they look. See what you've done, they're paying you. And when, you, when you've reached, reached a point doing pine straw, you know, and you can make it look a certain kind of way that people want to pay for, you want to give them what they're paying for. All right, I'll be back with the finish. All right, guys, and pine straw install. I'm done with it. Clean up. 
tucked, rolled, you name it. There it is. And again, guys, these beds, look for yourself, they're full. Here's the next bed. And you can take that to straw and see where that edge is around it. You shouldn't have pie, uh, straw hanging all over that on the concrete. You have a little, but I'll go back and I'll tuck that before I go. There's a little right there. And here's the other bed. And look how nice and thick it is. Put all your, 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 your straw in the bed. All back there in the back. And when you do a bed like this, when you make it look like this, guys, the neighbors are looking. Somebody else is going to want theirs done. And you can charge. And they'll pay it. This is the second time this guy said he'll be wanting this done every year. This is the second time I've done this. I did it at the beginning of the year back in March. I'm doing it now for holidays. Next year, depends on how it's looking in the spring, I may, you know, suggest that he does it again. You know, again, uh, all of our clients are, you know, they're, we're asking them to turn the lawn over to us, let us do everything for them. I'm going to come back probably around February, sometime probably in January. I'm going to put down a good weed and feed in here. Then I'm going to come back and I'll put him out some uh, seeds, some Bermuda seeds, and get his front yard really green. He's been with me now whole season. He says, I'm his guy, so I'm going to take care of him. That's what you get when you hire up scale lawn care. Hey, guys, you know it's what we do. There it is. Pine Traw install done. They'll drop plenty of leaves and so will that tree. It's not over.
All right, guys, there it is. And all I have to do is blow. And I blow most of it when I blow the uh, leaves, so I don't have a whole lot to blow. But uh, hey, that's it. Look pretty good.